had the pleasure of having two boys in my bed last night. Pippi and King Chuck. Now, Pippi, you sometimes do sleep in the bed with me because you are polite and you stay on your side of the bed. And if I move you over, you stay. But Chuck, you usually don't sleep with me at night because this is how much bed I had left all night. And you just like to cuddle really close. And then, then you stretch out with your big long legs and you knock me out of bed. Yes, you do. I slept on this much space, the amount of space that takes for Pip. He's 20 pounds, I'm more than that. Yeah. Are you just pretending to sleep? You are just awake. You're pretending to sleep so I don't make you get down, aren't you? You are. You are. So why did you sleep in my bed last night? Why? Because Mama let the puppy fall asleep with her on the couch until 2 a.m. Yeah. And yeah. You want me to spread the love around? Yeah. Someone's a little jealous. Yeah. So somebody got up in the bed and I couldn't move him. Are you, you cleaning his teeth for him, Pip? You, I know you want to be a dental hygienist when you grow up. Yeah. Oh, what a sweet young brother, huh? What a sweet kid brother. Look at him. He goes, wake up, Chucky. Oh, he's awake, Pip. He's playing dead so Mama doesn't get him out of the bed. You don't have to get out of the bed now. Now it's morning, I'm awake. Oh, look at you. You take up the whole bed. You have your own bed with an orthopedic mattress underneath it, right next to my bed, but no. You just had to have cuddles with Mama last night. I know, I get it. I love you, Bobby. We shared with Charlie last night, didn't we, Pip? Yeah. Yes, it's only fair. Uh -huh, I know. All right. Well, I didn't have work today, so. Who needs sleep?